you were driving down Dowlin Road today, you might have seen an unusual sight. A group of people marching on the side of the road carrying long guns. But it still drew the attention of many drivers. The group says they're exercising their Second Amendment right. It's not an everyday sight. Surprising, actually, but I'm just curious. I was just driving by and I thought it was interesting. Dozens marching down Dowlin Road in Beaumont. This, this just thrills me to see this. Carrying long rifles. Getting together so that Beaumont will be able to have citizens that can open carry their long guns without fear of being arrested. Following last month's arrest of Derek Poe, the owner of Golden Triangle Tactical. On this particular day, when I went into another store on the way to mine, and Beaumont police officers came in and stole my rifle. On that day, Poe carried a long rifle through Parkdale Mall. We got complaints and, and people who called in here were very uh, concerned and, and just outright fearful when they saw Mr. Poe walking through the, the mall with his weapon. Police later charged Poe with disorderly conduct. Because of that, we did confiscate the weapon as, a, as evidence. Today, these signs are posted on the front door and around the parking lot. No guns on mall property. Uh, I'm not going to be in there where I can't defend myself. Poe says it's why he's moving his store to a different location. It's, it's one of the Texas biggest secrets is you can open carry a long gun, but no one's used to seeing it. And no one's going to get used to seeing it until people don't start open carrying. A law these marchers are proudly embracing. Passing by no weapon signs with their long guns slung across their backs to a rally in Lowe's parking lot. What they say is a way to educate the public on Second Amendment rights. In Beaumont, Haley Bull. Beaumont police say they worked closely with the group to make sure the march was conducted safely.